Hello there. Today we are taking a look at Dragonfly from Small Tunes for Young Harpists by Bonnie Goodrich. The important thing to look out here is for the timing. One, two, three. It's really easy to slip in an extra beat. One, two, three, four. One, two. You can see what I'm doing. I added that extra beat and then tried to get my fingers on one at a time and it didn't work very well. So practice placing that right hand, all the fingers at the same time, quickly and cleanly. Something to be aware of is the poor old left hand doesn't play any note in this piece except G. So every time you go to place that left hand, it's going to be G. If it's another note that you play, you can be pretty sure that it's not right. Go for G. Each of the phrases in this piece repeats, and there are some dynamic differences that have been written in so that the first time you play it, it might be loud, and then the second time you play it, it might be soft. There's a good example of this in the second line, bar four. It's marked F, forte, loud. One, two, three, and then soft. One, two, three. The next phrase, you've got some alternating hands. watch the timing with those bars. That then repeats with a few dynamic differences again. Coming into the last few bars, it is a bit different though. So I'm going to pick it up from line, let me count, one, two, three, line four, bar four. Watch those notes and watch the counting. Let's go from the beginning of this one again. So pay attention to the timing and to the dynamic changes. So there is Dragonfly by Bonnie Goodrich from Small Tunes for Young Harpists.